none of them are being met by any sense of the deal that Theresa May is bringing forward. So I think the Labour Party should actually follow that, the logic of that through now and start campaigning clearly in saying that the Brexit deal that she's bringing back, there's no way Labour can support it if those tests are to mean anything. And I'd, like, I'd really like to see Tom saying they will whip against that, and I think that can be answered now. But do those, do those well, tests, are, are those tests important? Yes, of course they're important. But let me just say to Alistair, I mean, I know you used to be... Uh, a party sort of communications officer, but you're now talking to me as the editor of the New European. You've got a very strong position on this. We're in a, we have to listen to the whole of the British people on this, Alistair. And, I, I don't think and, we, and, we, and we've, got to, we've got to make sure that we honour uh, honor them by saying, you know, we're coming so out of the case, EU, but so it's so down what to you're saying deal. is whatever happens, whatever the cost, whatever the consequences, we're going to support whatever deal she brings back. No, what I'm that saying is... crazy. That what is I'm crazy. saying is... You no longer decide Labour Party politics. <laughs> no, I'm well aware of that. I'm sorry about that. I'm, well I'm aware sorry of that. about that. I know you'd like to. <laughs> I know you'd like but to. But I can put and, and I, you know, I know, I know they don't pay you a lot of money as the editor of the New European. Next to nothing. I mean, I, you know, I, you probably want George Osborne's job as a former person. I don't. Who used to be involved I'm happy in where I am, Tom. But, but, but I'm we, not happy with the, where, where you're pretending that you're doing something that different if you're basically in the same position, whatever we, happens, we, whatever we, the we're not. I'm going to 